News flash. Everybody eats flesh. Everybody eats flesh. All right? So, for those of you out there who are, as you are awakening and rising in your vibration with the planet, those of you who are criticizing people who choose to eat animal flesh, understand this. Unless you are a breath Aryan, you eat flesh. Because either it's spirit or it's flesh. See what I mean? So the only people who can brag about not eating flesh, truthfully speaking, are breath Aryans. So stop being so doggone critical of your fellow man or fellow woman. They are what they are. You are what you are, all right? Everybody moves and everybody grows in accordance with divine timing, all right? So stop being so doggone critical, family. Love your neighbor as yourself, all right? If you don't want anybody criticizing you, don't criticize somebody else. And, and God knows, don't criticize them for what they choose to eat because everybody eats flesh. I just finished downing a handful of cherries and two plums. And the spirit spoke to me and told me, you are eating flesh. It is just fruit flesh. It's the flesh of the tree, all right? So you're either eating the flesh of plants or the flesh of animals. Now, there's some safety reasons with regards to eating animal flesh, of course. I mean, you know, when you're eating fruit flesh, you don't have to worry about as much somebody injecting it with stuff. But I mean, look at all the pesticides they use, right? So, you know, people boast and say, oh, this person, if you just eat fruit and vegetables, you can live to be 90 or 100. Or this person ate meat and they died at 75 or 80. And it's some meat eaters that are living into their 90s. So what? You got an extra five years. I mean, are you that productive after 70, 75, 80 tops? Who cares that you got five years more than your neighbor? Truth be told, your neighbor probably luckier than you because they got to turn in their vehicle and get a new one sooner. Anyway, stop being so critical, man. Peace, y'all. Oh, and as an addendum, I know somebody's going to say, well, there's parasites in meat and, you know, fruit and... Let me stop you right there. A very near and dear friend of mine went and spent two weeks in Africa, okay? They spent two weeks in Africa. On their last day of that trip, they forgot to wash their fruit and had one of the worst parasite infections they ever had. That was fruit. They ate fruit. They didn't eat any meat. Y'all stop playing. Stop being so critical. Peace.